Hey guys, just before this video actually starts, I just want to let you guys know that OBS kind of messed up towards the end of the video, so at the end the audio is not as good as, uh, you know, at the beginning, but it should be fine though for most of the video. And yeah, enjoy. What is up, Degenerates? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today I'm here with Synthic. Hey y'all. That, that's all you have to say? Have <laughs> 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 I, I supposed to do a whole thing there? I no, had to like, I was... mute it because I didn't expect to say anything, sorry. Oh no, it's oh. it's fine. I was just wondering. <laughs> I thought you'd maybe <laughs> chime in there. I, I don't know. All right. Well, today we're gonna be reacting to the e EDP four four five allegations. Basically, if you don't know, Eat That Pussy four four five or EDP four four five is uh, a pretty popular YouTuber. He's got two million subs. Um, I knew about him for years, and like it's just devastating to hear about what's happened. Um, he's basically just messaged a bunch of underage you know, kids, and, uh, well, he wants to touch him. He beat his dick so goddamn hard. <laughs> I beat the fuck out of my dick so goddamn hard. Good evening, Twitter. This is your boy, Eat That Pussy 445 and about 30 to 45 minutes ago, I beat the fuck out of five orphan children so goddamn hard. Okay, so everyone's aware of the current drama going on. I mean, this shit's gone mega viral, right? But a lot of people don't know that this isn't even the first time he's done this so we got to go back we got to cover the entire history on this shit because we want to give you the most batshit crazy comprehensive report you know we are thorough investigators we don't stop until we discover the truth about eating that pussy all right <laughs> what's the oil wait what, what? <laughs> i don't know that's his name i didn't take it it's shit it's a bad name yeah but you make but it, it sound like we're just gonna eat pussy together like we're just gonna go to <laughs> go to town together <laughs> on just one <laughs> part two of this video will be up on the hub so we're gonna go back and we're gonna cover the original stuff that came out about edp and the stuff that started all these allegations so we're gonna go over the text messages that came out about them and then we're going to cover his two response videos, one that was so fucking bad that he deleted it. And he thought he could hide it from us, but he can't because we find everything. So that's what we're going to do here today. First, let's go over the text messages and then dive into the response. Let's check it out. So is everyone ready for a super, super romantic? No, that's not a good word for this. A super <laughs> fucked up screen reading of some amazing text messages. I'm I'm very ready. My dick is in my hand as we speak. All right, let's fucking do it. Do you want to be a uh, EDP or the 13-year-old decoy or 14-year-old decoy? Dude, come on. <laughs> is that even a question? You know who I want to be. All right, let's get it. <laughs> okay. I didn't know which one you wanted to be. You want to be EDP, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. I have to go <laughs> My profile pic was when I was 15. I lost weight and now I'm 129 pounds. I just want you, you only. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell nobody. Can you respond? Sorry, I'm here. I won't tell anyone. Oh, thanks, Daddy. I feel like you're going to expose me. How the fuck can I expose you? You have no pics of yourself up. If anything, it should be the other way around. I have dumb fucks on this EDP pedo shit. People know where I live and stuff. <laughs> In the first text, the second text message, he literally calls himself a pedo. At least he's self-aware, you know what I mean? Like, at least he's like, you know what? <laughs> These motherfuckers are trying to ex expose me on my pedo shit. Fuck you. Yeah, I want to continue even, like, my pedo shit. He's not even trying to hide it. He's just like, man, all these guys trying to, like, expose me as a pedophile. What inconvenient asshats they are. <laughs> yeah, what dickheads, man. God. <laughs> just trying to be a pedophile up in this bitch. Why do they make it so hard? Why does she make it so hard is the real question. <laughs> <laughs> okay, anyways, go on. So then it progresses. It gets worse. Uh, where he just acknowledges, you're 17 and I'm 29. Which in United States and anywhere, I think that's illegal. Like 17, 16 in Canada can only consent to the age of what, 20 or something like that? So like yeah. 17 to 29 is like way too big of a gap. Well, it's literally 12 years. <laughs> That's literally yeah, like a that fucking gr like seventh grader of a of an age gap. That's literally another minor of an age gap right there. <laughs> and then, and then something must have spooked him because he blocked he blocked the decoy. But then he unblocked the decoy because apparently he just could not resist himself. And this is what he sent. Good night, sweet dreams. <laughs> <sighs> 
Wait, can you do the, can you do your kiss again? Th thank you. I just wanted to hear that again. Okay. I really enjoyed talking to you. Same over here, LMAO face. So then he blocks the decoy again after that for some reason, I guess. Yeah, because when you block someone and unblock it, it deletes the chat. So no one can see it. Oh, that's I didn't even know that. Damn. Yeah, so okay. It's been trying to hide the evidence. I didn't mean to laugh. Me sorry, baby. Bay. It's okay. How can I make it up to you, ooh woo? Well, uh, if you want, uh, help me come. Next time I'm jerking off, lol. Sorry, I, I don't know why I, I tried to sound like Obama. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I was trying to do an Obama impression, but... Uh, <laughs> well, if you want, help me come next time I'm jerking off, lol. Sorry if that's weird. Yeah, that's weird, bro. That's a little <laughs> fucking sus. <laughs> All right, she's no, what, it's like... fine. He said sorry. Like, what more do you want from him, man? Right, he pulled the sorry card. <laughs> I'm a pedophile, sorry. Sorry, that's funny. A bad bitch like you. Do you really like me? We can keep it between us. I'm just tired of getting my heart broken. You're cute and stuff. Just worried this might be a fake profile. No, I keep it a hundred. That's for kids. Please, can we be with each other? Okay, I'm just gonna say that's like the most obvious <laughs> decoy ever. Like, how fucking dumb do you have to be? <laughs> no, no they one keep it a hundred. They keep it two hundreds. Yeah, well, it's they real. keep they keep it a hundred. He keeps it under fifteen. A hundred percent illegal. This this message though, the next one he sent is probably like the single most fuck fucked one. Can you imagine saying this to someone you think's a child? If you fuck me over, oh wait, no, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna read this in an angry voice. If you fuck me over, and if I find this combo someplace on the internet, like Twitter, or even in a YouTube video, uh, oh well, I swear on my mom's soul, I'll find your ass. Don't think for one second just because you're hiding behind a damn phone, you can't be found. Jesus. Sorry, I, I got. God. I, I got a little what? too too involved in that character there. Holy shit! Is that what he thinks flirting is? <laughs> <laughs> he's playing hard to get, dude. Nah, no, I, I feel like he, I feel like he's aware that it's weird and like he's aware that it's like wrong, but he's threatening that person because he he's hoping that it like it's a real person so that he can get away with it. It's like sh such a fucking like step up like literally within two messages he's like lol want to help me jerk off and i will find you and i will fucking kill you and your whole fucking family <laughs> but like do you want to help me jerk off next time but do you want to help me finish <laughs> I, I just gotta go get my skip food actually so okay. I, yeah i gotta go That's get my order time. yeah gotta get my food dumb you need your sustenance for this pedophile expose well you know <laughs> that miner is not the only one getting filled up you know <laughs> All right, I'm back. I, I don't have my headphones in, so I can't hear you, but I'm back. I honestly expected that to take way longer. You were quick on that shit. <laughs> yeah, dude, he, he was on that skip grind. Okay, so obviously that was like really, really bad or really incriminating shit. So what do you do when you find yourself as a big social media influencer in some hot water? You make the absolute shittiest fucking worst response video humanly possible and our boy edp man he pulled that off in this now deleted like series of clips where he uh decided basically to say yes i did it but like fuck everyone else it's not my fault so enjoy with us it's funny as shit. just like i mentioned before i've seen little punk ass motherfuckers exactly like cold raven come and go with these stupid ass goddamn hate videos with these dumb retarded ass mother Oh, I've exposed EDP. Look at this. Oh, we're going to try to get him canceled. We're going to try to, you know, get him locked up and thrown in jail. I've seen motherfuckers come here and be like, oh, he committed a crime, so he should go to jail. Punk ass fucking bitches saying that I should go to jail for committing a crime against a child. Fucking idiot. Whoa, dude, you have a problem with me sexting minors? Fuck you, dude. What's your problem? Punk ass bitches. <laughs> <laughs> what the what the fuck's going through your mind making a response being like it's all these other yeah i'm texting minors but it's their fault for showing the world <laughs> hey Fucking they idiot. hey they wanted to <laughs> i don't make the yeah. rules here man it's just it's, that's even it's just the start it only goes downhill from here let me tell you what the definition of a what is a and what's not a goddamn pet
You feel me? When you sit back, you feel me? And you have 15, 16, and 17 year old girls dressing up provocatively. You know what I mean? Dresses and skirts rammed up their little skimpy ass. You know what I mean? You know, walking around acting like they're big, badass, tough shit. They have a hidden agenda. They're over here trying to get like myself caught the fuck up, trying to sit back and set motherfuckers up and shit. No, the fuck they're not. <laughs> What's the fucking logic there? When these fucking little girls wear a dress, they're doing it with the sole purpose of tripping me up because I can't control myself around a child. So it's those stupid sluts' fault. Look, look. I, I know, I know I've been caught sexting minors, but like... Her ass was so fine. <laughs> That's gonna be taken out of context at some point in your fucking life. <laughs> No, but for real, that's what he's saying. He's like, God, if only they didn't wear those tight-ass skirts. <laughs> Every child needs to be wearing a full nun's attire constantly because I can't control myself. And it is clearly their fucking problem. Her ass looks great. Lock her up before I do something wrong. <laughs> she is clearly the problem here, not me, the pedophile. I'll do anything to get some attention. I'll do anything to get some attention from a big time YouTuber. You know what I mean? I'll sit back. I'll sell my body. I'll be a slut. I'll be a little skimpy ass. Bitch. And then when she doesn't go my way, oh, all of a sudden I'm going to screen record the boy and I'm going to try to get this mother set the fuck up and try to get him taken the fuck down. Maybe if you didn't fucking text her, you wouldn't have this problem yeah, yeah it, it seems like there's a pretty good solution yeah just don't text her <laughs> yeah don't engage with a minor and you don't have to worry about the engagements with a minor yeah it's it's a pretty it's a pretty solid solution just don't <laughs> don't text minors on your free time <laughs> yeah wow <laughs> wow what a hard concept it's like rocket science to me holy shit like <laughs> yeah i just i don't fucking understand it i'm too dumb God. Bitches who are 15, 16, and 17, dressing like little skimpy ass, walking around here, parading around here and shit, trying to set motherfuckers up, trying to message me and shit, and then when I respond back, all of a sudden, I'm the piece of shit. Suddenly, when I text these minors, I'm the bad guy? Yes, motherfucker, yes. <laughs> what? Hmm. So basically, you can see how that's like the shittiest response a YouTuber can ever give to a situation like this. So of course, he takes it down, he panics, he freaks the fuck out, and then he uploads another statement that we're not even going to give the time of day because it's so fucking stupid. Yeah. But basically, he just goes like, you know, I was trolling, I say ignorant shit all the time, you know, whatever, like, it's fine, like, I'm just joking around, which is like, so obviously not true. As we're about to find out in part two. Yeah, so part two of us reacting to this EDP four four five shit uh, will be up on Synthix channel. So go check him out. He's he's a great great content creator, great YouTuber, great TikToker. So um, yeah, if you if you want to see like the rest of this kind of collab, uh, go ahead check his. It's it should be up at the same time as my videos. So yeah, if you want to see part two, then go give him some love. Show him some love, but not too much. Like you know, not in the EDP way, please. <laughs> <laughs>